Let's do it. What's up, Simply Sasha 404 here, and today I'm doing a December slash 2013 favorites. So I really hope you guys enjoy it, and we're just gonna get started because, yeah, you guys know I like to talk, so yeah. So we're just gonna get started. Uh, yeah, I'm wearing this shirt again because I'm filming twice today. Um, but I changed my hair for you guys. Okay, so the first thing on my list is the Simple Makeup Wipes. Uh, Simple Sensitive Skin Expert Makeup Wipes. Self-explanatory, they're simple and they're for sensitive skin. Um, so yeah, I really like these. They're very gentle and they get off pretty much all my makeup. And yeah, that's that about that one. A lot of people, I think Beauty Baby, I think Miss Glamorati, Beauty Baby 44, I think too. But Miss Glamorati uses this and I have to hurry because my camera is dying. So that's that. The next one is my Urban Decay Setting Spray, which I've been using a lot of. Um, I bought it and then I stopped using it and then I started using it again because I noticed my makeup wasn't staying so I just sprayed this on after I used to do it before and after but now I don't so yeah love this beach cosmetics palette oh my gosh okay <sighs> I have to get it so this is my BH cosmetics special occasion palette and it's a 39 color eyeshadow blush palette and it just looks like this beautiful gold and it just has this stuff and these eyeshadows are amazing. If you want a review on it, I will do it in swatches. I can do it in another video. But this is just a, you know, favorite. So I really, really like it, especially this blush. I really like all the blushes. So this is an awesome palette. And yeah, I really like it. The next one I've been loving is my Laura palette. Oh my goodness me, guys. Guys, this is like better than the Urban Decay. I'm still so serious. I, I mean... Yeah, I think I like it better than my Urban Decay. I've been grabbing towards it more lately because I think it because it has mattes and shimmers. So it's a great neutral mix palette. If you don't have this palette, I recommend this palette. You need to get it. If you don't have the Urban Decay palette, you can get this palette instead because it's awesome. Love it. Okay, so the next one is the Pro Longwear Concealers. So I have two. Yes, two. If I can get the other one. I can't get it. Okay, so I have two of them, and I have it in NW45, and, this is NW45? Huh. I have an NW45 and NC50. So I have this one and this one. This one's for under my eyes, and this one's for all over my face, and a little bit, like, lighter. Like, this is for a light highlight, and this is for a heavy highlight. So, yeah, I really like these. These are awesome. You can use it as foundation. It covers up. It's amazing. No. No. Okay, guys, so I think the last thing I told you guys about was my um, Pro Longwear Concealer. Sorry, my um, battery died, so I had to go charge that. Okay, so I'm just going to keep going. So the next thing I love of December was my e.l.f. eyeliner and shadow stick. Well, I've just been using the eyeliner part, but I really like this. I think it was like a dollar, maybe two, but um, it just looks like this. It's an awesome eyeliner. It gets very black. I have it on my waterline today. And um, I used it on my mom last night. It's awesome. I'm obsessed with it. So, yeah. And the next thing I have is the Lorac Pro Line Pro Eyeliner. I think because it's a felt tip. And I've never used a felt tip eyeliner before. And this one is uh, just amazing. Like, I just, ugh. And it's so black. I just really, really like this. Um... I love this okay so the next one would be mascara and I've been using just a whole bunch of different mascaras but I really do like the big eyes um, volume Express by Maybelline I love this I have it on today I really love how it I really really love the lower lashes because it really gets it but this does lengthen and give me some volume to my lashes and I really like pairing it though I love pairing all of my mascaras with the Maybelline lots of lashes mascara I pair it I pair all of my stuff with that one but I put it in my video last month, so for my last favorite, so I don't want to put it in this one because, yeah. So that's that one. And then I have two lip products, which one of them I'm wearing on my lips right now. So I'll show you that one first. And it's the Color Burst. It's the Revlon Color Burst Lip Lacquers. 
Lacquer Bombs. And this is in the color Tease Seduck Rice. That's weird. Here, I'll show you guys if it focuses. Look at what this one is. So that's the name of it. And it just looks like this. I'm sure you guys have seen this before. And I'm wearing it on my lips. I'm kind of confused because I don't know if it looks pink to you guys. But it's like an orangey red color. So I've been really, really liking it. And I've been really liking this matte one. This is the matte bomb. And this is in Soul Tree. Soul for use. Don't know. But this is the name of it. Hopefully it focuses. There we go. So yeah, I've been really liking this too. And this is just like a really mauvey pink color and it really looks good on my skin tone so i really really like it is it back to focus okay so yeah i really really like it the next thing is the aquaphor lip balm i really really love this especially when it becomes in the drier months this is great lip balm and it's really really moisturizing and if you have chapped lips this will be your lifesaver on your lips like it's amazing hands down best lip balm i've ever tried last not last but lastly, things are this Vaseline Spray, Spray and Go Moisturizer. Once again, I don't know if I could tell you guys I'm lazy. So this stuff is amazing. All you do is just spray. And there it is. And you rub it in. It's very light. It's not sticky. It smells like Vaseline, like cocoa butter. This is the cocoa butter one. Yeah, cocoa butter is not greasy. It smells so good. It's really not greasy. See? It's no, like, shimmer or shine to it. I'm obsessed. I love it. I still, my mom bought these, but she, I like steal them from her. Next thing is this one. And I got this a long time ago from my dad's, uh, I think it's his ex-wife right now. So it's called Dream Angels Heavenly Angel Mist by Victoria's Secret. And I've had this for the longest time. Like, it's ridiculous. But did you guys see that? My, or hear that my voice just like really changed. But I really like it. It smells really good. Um, I never really sprayed it before, like never wore it. It's been sitting on my counter for like the longest, but I just never wanted to wear it. But it smells really good and I've been wearing it a lot lately. Okay, so the next couple of things are just um, non-beauty related stuff. So the first thing is my iPad mini. Been loving this. I just got it for Christmas. Yes, it's on my favorites because it's amazing. So, yeah, I just really, really love it. It's really fun. It's amazing. I have to change my background. My boyfriend says it's kind of annoying. I mean, I like it, but maybe I'll change it. And I'm going to get, like, a thousand cases for it. The next thing... Uh-oh. Did I break it? Oh, the next thing I have to show you is on the iPad. And it's this game that I've been completely obsessed with. And it's, like... It's not the um, Candy Crush, but it's like kind of like the same thing. It's like a glare. Ooh, here it is. It's called Pet Rescue Saga. Let me bring it up. Maybe there'll be no glare. There it is. It's called Pet Rescue Saga, and it's kind of like um, Candy Crush, but you're saving pets. Here, I'll just go to a random one for you because I'm kind of stuck at a stage right now. But um, this is how it looks, and then you just play it and stuff like that, and that's how you play so, yeah, I've been loving that. The next thing I'm obsessed with is Instagram. I don't know if I put this in a favorites. I think I did. But Instagram is my French toast and eggs and, and bacon. Like, it's amazing. Oh, I just got a thingy. I just put up a new picture. Okay, I just put up a new picture. It says, be crazy, be stupid, be silly, be weird, be whatever, because life is too short to be anything but happy. And then I put, in 2014... Just try to be happy, guys. Just try to be. So here's my picture. It's just me and then a picture of me and my cousin's doggy, which is so cute. And then the quote I read to you guys. So my Instagram is Sasha Dias. Um, here it is. If you want to go follow me, follow me. Holla at your girl. <laughs> that was so ghetto. Um, okay. That's that. And then the last thing is my book that my manager gave me. Let me grab it. Here it is. Um, I've been reading it. I ha I made kind of, not really a dent at all, but the first couple of pages are really informative so far and it's really made me get inspired to kind of start writing down concepts for my videos. Not videos, concepts for my songs. And I was going to say, you'll see it in a previous video, I'm pretty sure, my New Year's Revolution video, I talked about it. And this is really, really a good book um, if you're trying to, or if you want to be a songwriter. 
or if you're stuck because I have like writer's block for like a long time. So I really, really like this. It has a lot of information. It has um, information to like little side information on, you know, former record label executives. Former record label executives and managers, screenwriters, um, a hit songwriter and all that stuff. So it's amazing. I'm sure you can get this at Barnes & Noble and any other bookstore that sells the bunny or song dummies books. So, yeah, I think that's everything. That's everything on my favorites. I hope you guys enjoy this. Let me know down below what was your December favorites or your 2013, 2000, yeah, 2013 favorites down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and comment on anything you guys like. If you want to see a certain type of video or anything, let me know. If you want to see a review, let me know, and I'll see you guys on my next video.